Hey, hey. So I thought I'd take you through how exactly I use the ARC equine and what the protocol is for a human to use the ARC equine. Now, I definitely have to say that this is not FDA approved. This is not medical advice. If you use the ARC equine for yourself, on you, you're doing so at your own risk, basically. Um, I've never run across anybody who's had any issue with it though, but not medical advice. It's all up to you, your responsibility. So this is the ARC equine device. This is what you get um, along with the gel, the conductive gel when you buy the full package. Now this is kind of, we need to, I need to wash this because this is just where the gel has kind of congealed here. And there's still a little bit of gel on it right now. I, I use an alcohol swab, um, or I just swab it with alcohol, uh, after each use, but, uh, I just left it on because I'm going to be putting it back on to show you. So what you do, um, and I'm gonna show you this part first, and then I'll show you how I put it on. Now, the thing that the ARC equine comes with is this thing. You can also get an armband though, uh, if you prefer to use it on your arm. I prefer to have it on my leg. It feels less kind of intrusive, and it's actually easier for me to do yoga with it on. I can do pretty much all of my yoga poses with, with it on my leg in a certain place. So I'll show you what that is. So I like this one that it came with. I think it's recommended, it, it, and it doesn't matter where it is on your body. It doesn't need to be in any specific place because it's going throughout the whole body. Okay, so if you look here on the left, there's a little eye. This is the power button. Um, and, and also to charge, I didn't bring the charger, but to charge the charger, you just plug it in right here. So then after it finishes charging, you'll just plug this back in and that has to be plugged in. So then you're gonna hit start and you hold that down for a couple of seconds and then it flashes and this tells you that flash that you just saw, those three green lights, that tells you um, how much of a charge the battery has. So a full charge, of course, would be four green lights. Now, what it's saying right now is that this is the program that it's on. So the furthest left light, and you can change that program, right? So you would be starting off with program one if you, decide to do this. I started out with program one, which is the protocol. And that's over on the far left, if you're looking at it. And then to change it, you click on the, I'm sorry, you click on the power button, just, just really quickly. So now it's on P2, program two. Now it's on program three. Now it's on program four. Okay. So we'll go back to P1, because if you are doing this, this is most likely where, where you'd start. Then you wanna make sure that you have the gel on and you put just a little bit of that gel, you know, it, it comes out and you just um, rub it on there and on both of those. And then you strap it on your leg and you can do all these buttons while it's on your leg as well. Now where I put it, you can actually see where I had it just on just a few minutes ago, is on the inside of my shin, of my lower leg. And this means that, you know, like I said, I can do all sorts of fun yoga stuff without it hindering me and it doesn't really bump up against things and, and you wanna have it nice and tight. And what it'll do is um, see how it's flashing red right now. That means that I need to start it. So I'm gonna hit start. And that green 
I don't know if you can see that it's a it's a solid green right now. And what it should do is start to blink green. Now, I'm curious because if it's not conducting, if you don't have the gel on, then it will blink red. And that means that you need to make sure. So I do still have enough leftover gel on there that it blinks green. And that's it for how to put it on. Now I've already done mine for the day. See how now it's blinking red because it's not conducting, right? So I'm gonna turn it off. Now, as far as the protocol with the Arc Equine, you're gonna to want to do program one for one week, program two for two weeks, program three for three weeks, and then program four is maintenance. Let me see if I can remember this. Program one is for old, uh, I can't remember the exact, um, the, the exactly what each program is for. So I'll put that into the PDF so that you can see that. Uh, but that's the basic protocol. It's super easy. And, you know, so far the benefits are pretty amazing. It hasn't been like life-changing for me, but definite improvements in lots of different areas. You can see my uh, weekly ARC equine experiment updates for what I've been experiencing. And it's totally, I mean, it's totally worth it to me. So let me know if you have any questions.